All right, so is your shoulder rotator cuff pain still hurting you, that impingement that hurts so much when you reach up overhead or behind your head? And you've been doing these exercises that you've seen on, by therapists and on YouTube channels, and we do teach these. They're good exercises. It's not helping. Yeah, if it's not helping, we're going to show you the trick that may just get you over that hump and make you pain-free. Just a little quick insight on what muscle in particular is causing the problem and why you're not progressing. The it's problem child. The problem child. It's the pec minor. That's the muscle. You got the pec major here. It's underneath there. It connects to the caracoid process, which is it's part, part of the shoulder blade. Right. So, well, let's go back to over here. <laughs> It's, it's right here, Long and that side. bone is directly part of the shoulder blade. That muscle can get tight, and it pulls that shoulder blade and locks it in place, which allow, or does, makes it so you cannot do this or this because the shoulder blade is locked up. We need to free that muscle up, and we're going to show you a couple simple techniques you can do. Simply take, if it's your left shoulder, take your right hand, others, otherwise the opposite. You're going to go into that muscle right here. Now you have to get through the pec major and you're going to push deep. And you, you may want to do a cross friction massage, which is up and down, but you're going to get in deep. Now, if you feel a tender spot, and it'll make you bite a little bit, you're probably got that, tie, that knot in the pec minor and you want to work that knot out. I do. Ooh, ooh, yeah. If it says makes you say ooh, -wee, and then it's okay. Keep working on it. After about 30 seconds of that ooh, -wee, it should break loose and feel good. Now, if your fingers are starting to get sore and tired, uh, and you happen to have a massage gun or you want to get one, it would be an ideal place for it. You don't have to have one. Simply use your fingers and get that muscle loosened up. Massage guns work really good. Just because, especially the ones that like we have, we saw they reciprocate, six to 10 millimeters would probably be good. And it's so easy, much easier. Easy. Yeah. Now you can bring it in like this or go at an angle and you do what feels right. Like right there, I can feel it. Now I have this problem on this shoulder from my swimming and I'll actually get in and go from the bottom up and it really loosens it up well. You do what works best for you. You work it around, ooh, and then you can play. Ah, uh, that uh, kind of. <laughs> All right, that's enough play. Let's go on. Oh, I do want to mention the softball for getting a deep tissue in there, so you don't have to use your hands and get your fingers sore. And if you don't have a gun, softball. Go up against a like a piece of trim on the wall, so the ball can't roll. It kind of goes up against the trim on the door, uh, or if you have a wall anchor, it works good. And Get that right in there and just roll on that up and down and relax that shoulder. And you work that for a minute or two. It, it doesn't work quite as well, but it works okay. You know, it's a good option. All right, we've got some simple stretches that will also get that muscle to stretch out. If you have an open corner like this, arms will go like this. And you may go up and down depending on how it feels. Go into that corner of the wall and just lean forward and you'll feel that, again, move it up and down. You're not going to go real high like this. It's going to be somewhere at this level and hold it 15 to 30 seconds. Do that throughout the day. Nobody put that in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, watch out for the corner you go into. All right, be careful. Now the next one. Okay, the next stretch, if you've got a stick four to five feet long, a broom handle, a piece of PVC, whatever, we're using the Booyah stick. On a chair that's not real soft, not a soft, cushy chair, but a chair, put the handle here, the walk stick here. Walk the hand up. Yep, walk the hand up, and then you simply bob. slide down. Right. And lean forward with a good grip on there, and you will definitely feel a nice stretch on that shoulder. You may want to roll out to the side a little bit, and that way, can you come this way too, Bob? Yep, more abduction. You'll feel that tight muscle. You know, when you hit that spot, it'll start, oh, there it is, and then you may work that. Again, 15 to 30 seconds. Relax as much as you can. Breathe, take a breath. And now the last one, if you happen to have a uh, pull-up bar or something you can hang onto. You can do it with two hands, but it's going to be 
what we call hanging or brancating. Uh, if you got a pull-up bar, we use the hanging handles. Uh, this is actually our pull-up bars, but the hanging handles actually work a little better because you get closer to the wall. A key is to get your back up against the wall. It helps. Not necessary. You can do it again on a pull-up bar. Slowly let yourself down. Stretch. Stretch. You know, I can feel you're getting a lot of musculatures. This does not isolate that pec manor, but it does get at it. And hold it 15 to 30 seconds. Don't get too aggressive the first time, that's for sure. Take your time. It might take yep. you a few days. You, you just do it. Yeah, you can just do one hand if this is a side. And the nice All thing right. about this is you can rotate around and get, like, right there, I can feel it deeper. The handle rotates. Yeah, it's nice to have a rotating handle as well. All right. Good. I'm feeling pretty good stretch out right there. I can feel it get in there nice. How's the pec? Oh, yeah, that pec is doing good. The pec minor. All right, very good. That's a critical muscle for that motion of that arm. Getting behind your head. Just watch that in service. He says every time he has someone that can't get behind his head, he goes after the pec minor for sure. So, sure. Bob, the, anything else? The villain. The villain, yeah. yeah. The villain pec minor. Take care. <laughs>